Hey everybody, it's me, Kristen. Uh, well, Happy New Year, and we are getting some snow here, so that's pretty exciting. Uh, it'll probably turn into freezing rain any time now. <laughs> so, I just wanted to make this little video telling you about this neat, um, this is not a product placement, but <laughs> I am very happy with this glue that I found. You guys might already know about it, but if you're like a crafter person, you might want to know about this glue. It's called PVA glue. It's a book binding glue and it is so good because it dries really fast and um, it it makes it so well you use a brush like this to put it on and everything so um, it spreads out really evenly and I just want to show you so I made this book with the glue um, let's see for my project for school and it turned out really smooth even on the back it's pretty smooth like the only these are just problems because the of the cardboard but um, otherwise the glue didn't cause any weird ripples for the most part it was just like my lack of skills <laughs> that caused the bubbles but um yeah, so I've been using this glue for projects lately. I think I heard about it on a video. It's just called PVA glue. It's pH neutral and let's see, it is for book binding and for paper projects. So if you have some paper projects, I would totally recommend it. Um, I just use a, let me get this out. I have this little container that I put the glue in and then I just take the brush and put it on my project but um, the glue is water soluble so uh, you can just rinse out the little dish or you can use a paper plate or whatever I think you just use a regular plate and just wash it off so it's a really good uh, book or it's a glue, good glue for paper I would even say I don't know if kids can use it um, I don't know what the what parents think of kids using glue. I don't know if they could eat it and still be safe or I'm not really sure but I think like a 12 year old who could be safe with this you know obviously a 12 year old is not going to really eat glue. Well some might. <laughs> anyway this costs about I'd say seven dollars a bottle this size and it lasts a really long time. It's it's like eight ounces and um, you can find it on Amazon or in craft stores or whatever. And so I want to show you guys my Christmas book to Christmas ships book that I made. I'm not going to show you all the pages, but here we go. It's my uh, brand book for my Christmas ships project. And I just made this uh, book out of cardboard I had around. And I watched some videos about how to make a book and it turned out pretty well so I was really happy with it. Now I have to figure out where I'm going to store it. Um, and I did this binding which was really simple. You just cut four holes and then you string it through. The back is like is where you tie it so yeah that was a pretty easy binding technique and you just cut the paper the holes in the paper and in the book cover too. So, um, I guess that's it for the video. I just wanted to tell you about the glue because I really love it. I didn't know about it, you know, before, so I wish I would have known about it years ago. <laughs> um, and I hope you all are having a good new year. Uh, I think it's ice raining now here, so <laughs> it might be snow, but I'm not sure. I guess I better go look outside. And I hope you all are healthy and happy and enjoying your time and I start school tomorrow so we'll see if school even goes tomorrow because um, because of the bad weather so I'm not sure <laughs> okay stay safe out there talk to you guys later bye